How did you happen to call him Harvey? Well, Harvey's his name. How do you know that? Well, it was a rather interesting coincidence on that, Doctor. One night several years ago, I was walking early in the evening down along Fairfax Street. It was between 18th and 19th. I, you know the block? Yes, yes. I, I just put Ed Hickey into a taxi. Ed had been mixing his rye with his gin, and, and he, I just felt that he needed conveying. Well, anyway, I was walking down along the street, and I, I heard this voice saying, Good evening, Mr. Dog. Well, I, I turned around, and here was this big six-foot rabbit leaning up against a lamppost. I, I thought nothing of that, because when you've lived in a town as long as I've lived in this one, you get used to the fact that everybody knows your name. And naturally, I went over to chat with him, and, and he said to me, he said, Ed Hickey was a little spiff this evening, or could I be mistaken? Well, of course, he was not mistaken. I think the world and all of Ed, but he was spiffed. Well, we talked like that for a while. And then, and then I said to him, I said, you have the advantage on me. You know my name, and I don't know yours. And, and right back at me, he said, what name do you like? Well, I, I didn't even have to think twice about that. Harvey's always been my favorite name. So I said to him, I said, Harvey. And, uh, he, and th th this is, this is the, the interesting thing about the whole thing. He said, what a coincidence. My name happens to be Harvey.